Kenny here again. I want to take a minute to talk about ATK testing leaving Thailand. Currently, the United States requires everyone flying into the U.S. to have a negative ATK test uh, no more than 24 hours old prior to boarding your first flight. So with that said, we had from sometime 7 a.m. today to 7 a.m. tomorrow to get that test done. We were gonna wait and do it at the airport, at Suvu Barmi Airport tomorrow morning because there's a company online that has a testing site at both Don Mulong and Suvu Barmi. Um, I decided I wanted to do it today in case there was an issue, uh, we could address it. We had previously bought in two home tests because I wanna test here at the hotel before we go get tested by some facility. Um, that way, if there was an issue, we could come up with a game plan on what we were gonna do, because I believe if you test positive there, then you have to go to a hotel, or excuse me, go to a hospital retest, and if you test positive, then they're gonna put you in quarantine. Um, I'm not real sure how that affects the US side of it or, or what, but I didn't want that to happen, so I wanted to test to make sure and if we did test positive, I'm going to be honest with you, we'd have come up with another plan, extended our stay, changed our flights. I don't know, we'd have did something. But uh, anyhow, so testing today, uh, Don Wong Airport is near our hotel, so we decided to go over there this morning. After we did our at-home test and tested negative, we went and grabbed some breakfast, headed over to Don Wong Airport. At Don Luang Airport, there is a sky bridge that runs from the airport across all the roads, the railroad tracks, and all that other crap to a Hotel Amari, A-M-A-R-I, I believe it's spelled. In that sky bridge, this company has a temporary testing uh, site set up. They just have a table and a computer and a couple little shade things that you go behind to get tested. All you need to do is take your passports with you, go in there, and uh, it's 450 baht per person, which is about 15 US dollars. Takes about five minutes. They will print you out a piece of paper that you're required to have to give to the airline before you board. You have to have that piece of paper. You cannot use your own home test. So for $15 and five minutes there, um, test negative, get the piece of paper, and that's all there is to it. That sky bridge, if you take a taxi or a bus or something, there's bus stops and taxis right there. No matter which way you're going, into or out of Bangkok, just have them drop you off right there at that sky bridge that crosses from the airport to the hotel. Sidewalk, there's staircases up, go into that uh, sky bridge and you'll see it set up there. Um, but I will tell you, the company on their website advertises that they do them at both Don Mulong and Suva Barmi. But I asked the lady, and she said they don't do them at Sivu Barney anymore. They have a location near there. The other thing you need to understand and need to know is that the hours for this test location doesn't start open until 6 a.m., and I don't remember what time it closes, but I'll post it right here. Um, but don't expect to go down to Sivu Barney or Don Muang at 4 o'clock in the morning and get your test, because that's what I was going to do. Glad I didn't do it. But anyhow, everything turned out okay for us. We're all set. We're ready to go. Well, I don't know if we're ready to go because we don't want to leave. But we got everything that we need to get out of here. Um, so tomorrow morning, uh, that's our plan. We'll go down to Suvu Barmi, show them our piece of paper, a negative test, and we'll head back to the U.S. Um, I don't know if you have any questions or comments. Put them down below. I um, don't know if this will help anybody, but hopefully it will. Some Pitt and Kenny, well, she's not here, but Some Pitt and Kenny, stay tuned. Mm -hmm.